directionally challenged hiker here this Tuesday, March 28th. Um, we just hiked down to Granite Rapids. Um, last time I was through here with my friend and her daughter, we actually spent two nights at Granite Rapids because it has this awesome beach. Um, I will take you down to that awesome beach in just a couple minutes here. Just doing a pan of the area, but pretty sure the river is running higher at this point. Sort of makes sense, but there's there's been a few changes. Um, yeah. So first change is, and I know this is kind of crazy, that big hunk of wood with some rocks on it used to be down along the shore and I would sit on it by this tree and I would filter my water. So someone was extremely motivated and rolled it up here to be used as a camp table along with that other hunk of wood that was probably found along the shoreline. And it's really cool because they are, they are crazy smooth. Oh my goodness. And it just looks, I think it looks so awesome. So cute little sight up here. Um, but looking up there, we still have some snow up top. Um, but down here, no snow. There are clouds today. We're kind of hoping those go away and this breeze dies down, but can't do much about that. So I'm going to take you down to where we camped those couple of nights. All right, we are looking down into that little camp area. All right, so here we have it. That is where I pitched my tent. Those probably a couple few years ago now, it was November. And then um, we kind of, this was our kind of kitchen area. And then over here, my friend and her daughter, who was still hiking with us at the time, they set on up over here. So, yeah. I would love to stay down here again someday. Not this trip though. So next up, I'm gonna show you that awesome beach. And as I approach the beach area, um, Ugh, my brain just blanked. As I approach the beach area, um, okay, that big hunk of wood that I talked about used to be setting right in there. Next to where that little, like, kind of pathetic tree is coming out of the sand and going over. But this is the beach area of Granite Rapids, and yes, the Colorado is chocolate milk today. Um, and I will. I will try to put in at least a couple pictures, maybe a video clip of what this looked like the last time I was down here, just for some perspective. Um, right now, it is mostly a rocky beach. Um, the the water level has been way up, up to that one boulder there and beyond. Um, last time we were here, there was quite a bit. Um, just out in front of me here was probably more sand. Um, so yeah, the Colorado River level is definitely up right now. Um, but we've had a very wet winter, snow, rain, you name it. But this used to be our like chill out spot in the afternoon, um, play in the river, uh, run along the beach or try to. I don't know if I try to do that now, I would get tangled up in the driftwood. But yeah, amazing change. Um, but still awesome. I am so glad we came down today. But I'm gonna 
get up here just a little bit way a little bit of a ways further if that makes any sense i am pretty tired and then i will turn around and look up river for you but yeah very very different so just if you're headed down this way and you've been down before um maybe give you a little bit of an idea of what to expect the changes um if you haven't been down this way this is what it's looking like right now um if things slow up a little bit that river should go back to its awesome colorado river green but it may be a while as i'm thinking there's quite a bit of snow melt off we're going to be having in the upcoming month or so so guess that is it for now um until next time directionally challenged hiker here looking down at the beach and camp area of granite rapids for some perspective and now for those comparison photos as we look up river here there is my water filter bag but that hunk of wood has been relocated and then as i've sat and looked through photos from my previous couple trips it's been pretty cool to see if i remembered things correctly um, the water level was higher in 2020 than i think my brain was remembering but the beach was sandier um, I definitely remember the sandier beach. And then in 2021, um, there was a bit more rock than I was thinking, but it was still pretty decent compared to this year, at least. I mean, this year, the water is up, the rock is up, and I don't know where all that driftwood came from. Well, yeah, I know where it came from, but I don't know. Maybe that's the draw of going back to the Grand Canyon. It's, it's never the same. Um, the seasons affect it. The lighting affects it. I mean, as I look at some of these photos, the time of day that they were taken just makes different colors pop, makes the water reflect. Anyway, now for the epic beach run or not. Until next time, actually a challenge.